Hi there, this is Jeff Blake for Infinite Skills, and I want to welcome you to our look at responsive web design. We're going to have a lot of fun together. Essentially, what we're going to do is we're going to build a responsive web layout. That is a layout that responds to the type of device that is being used to view the layout. We're going to build this layout from complete scratch from start to finish starting with blank files. So I think you're really going to enjoy this. Before we really dig into it, though, here's a quick look at some of the topics that you and I are going to address here together. Right off the bat, I want to make sure that we have an understanding of responsive design, how it functions, what it is, what we're going to be targeting, and so on. And then we'll have a conversation on the tools of the trade, tools of the web design trade. And as it relates to Dreamweaver CS6 specifically, I'd like to have a short discussion anyway, maybe a, a handful of lessons or exercises related to working with responsive designs in Dreamweaver CS6. And then from there, what we'll do is we'll get ourselves set up for our responsive design. We'll get ourselves prepared. We'll set up our files. We will set up our media queries as well inside our external style sheet. And we'll also build our HTML structure, the raw structure for our layout. From there, what we'll do is we'll go through the first stage or first phase of the design process. That is the wireframing process. So we're going to wireframe out three layouts, a high resolution, a medium resolution, and a low resolution wireframe layout. And then from there, what we'll do is we'll apply formatting to the three device layouts, and then we'll start inserting some graphics and formatting those graphics using some CSS. And I have some CSS related tricks that I want to show you related to working with your graphics as they relate to building responsive designs. So I hope that sounds good. I hope that sounds like a lot of fun. Let's jump into it. Here we go. This is responsive web design.